As I see it, the major opportunities for agroforestry to be of significance to the world in the future uh, revolve around um, the combination of our science in solving problems of both food security and climate change. Um, in fact, um, agroforestry is now attributed to be one of the very few areas of agriculture where you can combine in a win-win situation uh, solutions on the farm that provide more food, better livelihoods, and reduce the emissions due to greenhouse gases because of the sequestration of carbon that these systems um, particularly exemplify, and the adaptation of agricultural systems better to climate change because trees have deep root systems and they are more resilient to drought and climatic variability than annual crops naturally are. Now with the combination of these factors, we have a huge responsibility because as agroforestry is recognized um, by the African Union and the international organizations as such an important key to um, both surmounting food insecurity and climate change, we have to accelerate our efforts in the science of, of producing the technologies and the policy solutions that can do this. And I have full confidence that we're on the right path to doing that. And I see over the next 10 years an enormous increase in the impact of agroforestry because at this particular moment in time, there is a turning point in people's appreciation of what the role of trees and farming systems can really do. Two points that uh, really stand out. One, of course, is the ability of the center to develop technologies for the poorest farming families through what we call evergreen agriculture. And um, particularly emphasizing the role of getting the right types of fertilizer trees into food crop systems to provide uh, vast new and free quantities of organic fertilizer for farms without the, um, the, the, the opportunity to use uh, chemical fertilizers. These are a costless way that farmers can in fact approach the problem of doubling or tripling their yields and by doing that uh, increasing their f overall food security on an annual basis. These technologies also um, sequester carbon and in fact do that um, to a degree of an order of magnitude greater than conservation agriculture, the best conservation agriculture practices uh, of zero tillage or minimum tillage. And thus we have identified solutions that have an enormously greater potential effect on uh, increasing our ability to reduce emissions of greenhouse gases. So our science has got to take this up and, um, and really provide the solutions, the methodologies, the policy, um, the policy uh, uh, solutions that will in fact carry us forward uh, to in instituting these practices on the ground on millions of farms in the tropics over the next several years. It's a very exciting opportunity and the realization of the global community that agroforestry has this opportunity uh, is one that we need to grab and to run with, with as quickly as possible.